Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is JT from Above and Below the Belt. I have some more news about Tevin Farmer who's still uh, calling out uh, calling out uh, Javante Davis. He said, uh, enough talk, I want you next. Which he's talking about Javante Davis. Um, what do y'all guys think about this? I'm, I remember what I told y'all. I said, um, Tevin Farmer, um, he's a slick fighter. Javante, Javante Davis is not a, a slick fighter. He's like a brawler. Uh, 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 he's a what, what? What do they? What people say? He's more like a um, he's a, a a puncher boxer, and Chevin Farmer is more of a boxer puncher. I would say, you know, um, this would be a, um, would it? Would this be an interesting match? You never know, but I still think that Javante Davis still got the edge because he's got a lot of power. But you never know, man. But uh. Tevin Farmer's not calling out for no reason, but at the same time, look what happened to Robert Easton and uh, Mikey Garcia. Robert Easton was calling out uh, Mikey Garcia. Mikey Garcia didn't, want, didn't, didn't take the fight right away. He still was hesitating, but he, he took the fight and he beat Robert Easton. So watch out who you call out. You know what I'm saying? So maybe he might see something. He might see a fall in Javante Davis. That's what I'm. That's what I'm thinking. That's why he still call him out because he really don't have to call him out because nobody ain't even talking about the fight no more at the same time. But he still call because I remember. I remember. Uh, I think it was a month ago, or whatever. Um, Tevin Farmer was at a fight and Javante Davis was there, but I think Javante Davis was kind of drunk, but he still was talking to him until he want the fight. So. I don't know, man. Some people say Chevin Farmer. Some people, a, a, a lot of people, gonna say Javante David because he got the spotlight. He's with Mayweather and and the, the, how he knocking out people in the ring, and you know what I'm saying. So that that plays a part in it. But um, like I say, uh, you never know. It's always a bunch of uh, a boxer puncher, and and it's all about the IQ in in the ring at the same time. So um, you know, but I still go with Jav Javante Davis. But you never know. But um, but you know, uh, Chevin Farmer is with uh, Lula Bella, and uh, he's on the zone. He, they, you, you will be seeing him on in, on the zone, and um, he feel he really he feel really good about himself. And um, he's got a fight. Uh, Chevin Farmer got a fight. Um, he have a fight. He he's going to be defending his uh, IBF World Featherweight Title against James Ten Tena Tennyson Tennyson. At the TD Guarding in Boston on Saturday night, live on the zone. So, um, yeah. So, um, and he, I think, uh, Tevin Farmer, um, um, he's, um, he's gonna, um, oh yeah, yeah. He's, he's definitely gonna be, um, um, this definitely gonna be a fight that people want to see. I would say, because it's been, it's been, they, they had words with each other and Javante Davis. And uh, but he says he's not overlooking James uh, Tennyson, um, uh, which uh, he's gonna be fighting uh, this uh, this upcoming Saturday. I'm thinking. So um, hey man, the zone look like it's um, the zone look like it's uh, it's it's warming up. You know, uh, Canelo Alvarez is trying to deal with the zone, and um, uh, Demetrius Andra Andra Andrade is uh, with the zone, and um, I think uh, matter of fact. Uh, Daniel Jenkins with the zone, uh, Josh was with the, the, the zone, and now uh, Tevin Farmers with the zone. So they got they get they 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 they, they slowly uh they slowly trying to make a move. I see it, and um, I think it's a good move now. So maybe the other people might um uh, might might go over to the zone. You, you never know. So, but but um, what do y'all guys think about this? About Tevin Farmer still calling out Javante Davis? Do you think it's just he just blowing smoke or he just talking or or do you think that um he really want to make the fight because of of course this is gonna be a you know I think it's gonna be good money involved in this fight and um you know what do you, what do you guys think leave a comment at the bottom of my page subscribe to my page like my page hit the bell icon for new notification new videos from me this is JT from Above and Below the Belt all right bye.